What is up guys? We are back in the pirate camp talking to the people figuring out if we can live here and be happy. Hey you! How are things going with you? What's up? Did Henry send you here? Tell him to get his planks as soon as I'm done. If he can't wait that long, he's welcome to saw them himself. But there was also a dude sawing outside. What are all these planks for? We use them for the palisade, you dimwit. Greg thought it would be a good idea to secure our camp this way. We can save ourselves the work if you ask me. If the bandits are really planning to attack us, this ridiculous palisade isn't going to stop them. We should have never tolerated them in our valley in the first place. If I'd known all this in advance, I'd have stayed in Karunas. Can I help you saw? Nah, I can handle this by myself. I joined up here not long ago, and letting others do my work won't get me anywhere if you get my drift. We get your drift. I'm looking for Angus and Hank. <sighs> I have no idea where they are. The bandits must have got them. You were friends with them, weren't you? All I know is that they were going to meet up with the bandits in a cave not far from here. It must be somewhere outside our camp, to the east. I don't know where exactly. I've never been there myself. Maybe you should ask Alligator Jack about this. He's always roaming around outside the camp. Can I help you? Now. Nah. You've been to Carinas? Yes. I kept myself afloat there, picking pockets and doing a little swindle or two. But whenever fewer ships came in, business got worse and worse. At some point, I got tired of being on the run from the militia for a few crusts of bread. That's when I joined Greg. Now I'm stuck here, sawing all day to build a palisade that's of no use to anyone. Can you teach me something? Well, I could show you how to pick other people's pockets unnoticed, but you should be fairly dexterous, or you can just forget it. Well, I already know how to do that. Thank you, Bill. Let's see. Don't tell me you didn't know that. You hardly know who to believe these days. Oh, that was it? Do you really believe that? Did we just ruin a quest That's line a thing? We might have. Well, that's what you get for trying to steal people's stuff all the time, I guess. Let's see. I don't know where we're supposed to get. Is the grog just gonna be up and about for Skip? She's just gonna be everywhere? Buried? What does our quest lock say? Skip has allegedly lost 20 bottles of grog to the bandits. He wants them back. Okay, so bandits. Don't know which bandits, but bandits. Who are you? Technically, if I just get 20 bottles of, rum, uh, of grog, we're good? Is that what it is? Or do I have to get those ones specifically? <sighs> What's up? I'm here to deliver some meat. Ah, uh, I need a, a sip to wake me up. This glorious black screen of the wall. That's better. So again, uh, what do you want? I'm here to deliver some meat from Alligator Jack. I remember. Right. The meat. Give it here. What are you doing here? Greg made me commander of one of the two raiding troops. I'm responsible for keeping the camp supplied. Alligator Jack sees to that. I'm also responsible for keeping those beasts you find out here well away from the camp. That's what the boys do. I told him I don't want to see a single beast left around here when Greg comes back. Do you ever do anything yourself? Hey, none of that lip. Mine is the most important task of all. I train my people. I make them into the best and most fearless fighters who ever sailed these waters. And it's not like the lads do all that work for nothing. 
They get a good sized bag of gold for their efforts. I want to join your troop. <laughs> my troop? My troop is hanging out at the beach. Those boys won't lift a finger until the captain is back. You can count on that. But if you want to show everybody what you're made of, feel free to work on the northern beach. It's full of lurkers and who knows what else. Take them on by yourself and you'll earn the respect of the people. Welcome to my troop. <laughs> I'll go lie back down. <sighs> What's up? We weren't done talking, guy. What do you think of Francis? I don't mind him, as long as he leaves me alone. Isn't he the boss around here? <laughs> he thinks he's the boss. But at some point, Greg will return, and then Francis gets to go back to Sarin Plax. <laughs> Can you train me as well? Sure, I can show you how to fight with one-handed weapons. About Angus and Hank. Oh, don't remind me of them. They probably got themselves killed by bandits, and Angus had my ring on him. Well, sure, it was his ring, in a way. He won it from me playing dice, but I would have gotten it back, and now it's gone. If you find my ring, bring it back to me. I'd certainly make it up to you. Go lie back down. Ah, great idea. He's a special kind of lazy. Also, if there's a weird background sound, um, Cleo's on my lap, sleeping and purring. Ah, a new face. What do you want, rum or something stronger? I want to talk to you about Francis. Just don't mention that wannabe captain. He sits on his fat ass all day, acting important. We'd all like to know what the hell the captain was thinking when he put him in command here. What do you want from that prig? I must get into Greg's hut. Really? To do what? I need a bandit's armor. Ha <laughs> ha! Francis will never agree to let you go into the hut so that you can nab a few of Greg's things. Unless... Yes? You've got something he really wants. I know that Francis has hidden something in an abandoned mine in the canyon. Once, when we were on guard duty together and he dozed off as always, he went on about it in his sleep. I've no clue what he buried there, but maybe it's so important to him that he'll let you into the hut to get it back. <laughs> when the captain comes back and finds some of his things are missing, he'll have Francis's hide for it. I want something stronger. Ah, a seeker. I'm always after new recipes myself. Decent booze should be clear and strong and burn your throat like liquid fire. You don't find that very often. But I'm talking too much. You want a drink? Here, my own recipe. How do you like that? I call it hasty herring. Ooh, impressive. <laughs> you can say that again. You wouldn't happen to know a good recipe for booze yourself. If you do, you must tell me. Want another? Give me some of your hasty herring. Rather vile muck, but effective. Give me some of your hasty herring. Rather vile muck, but effective. Give me some of your hasty herring. Rather vile muck, but effective. I just figure I take enough in case we need them for other people. What else have you got? I can get you anything a pirate needs in order to survive. He says and basically all he has is weed, ham, and... Fair enough, though. Fair enough. What's new in the camp? Nothing much has been happening here since Greg left. Morgan and most of his boys been just hanging around and boozing all day. The only one who does anything at all is Henry. He and his boys are building the palisade. It's high time for Captain Greg to come back and give that Francis a good swift kick in the ass. Agreed. He won't even give me a quest. Whoa. Oh my god. That is super cheap for something that does this. 
We need a bunch more of this stuff. A bunch more. Hey, you. I'm so excited. Here you go. Ah, down the hatch like liquid fire. Teach me something. Okay, fair enough. Um, have we leveled in the meanwhile? We have actually. But I don't remember what Alligator Jack could teach us. People. So technically, I'm not, I'm not gonna. You. I'm not gonna do it yet. At some point, we are gonna go to that mine in the canyon so we can see if we can get uh, the thing to trigger the quest anyway from. Francis? Now let's see. They were talking. He was saying Northern Beach. Okay, we are on our way to the Northern Beach. And then Greg's treasure was on the Southern Beach. What kind of creatures? Okay, lizards. Let's see if I can find a bed or something. If I can find a bed and take a nap, it's morning. Wow, look at that sunset. Yes, it's a sunset. That's beautiful. You guys are quite lucky, lucky men. It's all just gossip. Um, Skip, can I use your bed? Okay, that saved us some healing. So that makes me happy. Lizards should be okay. But maybe we can skin them if we talk to Alligator Listen, Jack. So maybe we're gonna... He was right outside this town anyway. I haven't heard the general sound glitch anymore. Only the uh, the arrow thing. But that's okay, that's fine. Is your house over here? Okay, alligator. What, what was it you could teach me? Hey! Teach me. What is it you want to learn? I have no clue. Yes, okay. There is nothing else I can teach you. You have become too good. Wait, what? Always make the cut at the belly, or the quality will suffer. Does that mean we already know how to pull teeth? There is nothing else I can teach you. You have become too good. There is nothing else I can teach you. You have become too good. Okay, fair enough, but we did learn something. Do you know Angus and his friend Hank? I haven't seen them in a while. And I wouldn't mind if the pair of them never came back. Why? Oh, those bums always hung around the lake, scaring off the game. What lake would that be? Remember our hunt? Yep. The lake in the hollow. That's where I usually saw them. But we've already been there, and I think we already tried to loot most of it. Oh, but there was like a something cave-esque, wasn't there? I think there might have been. We'll go check it out again. This place is beautiful, but I feel like you can do a lot of things wrong. I love it, though. I'm excited. I'm just not excited about the fact that pretty much everything can... End my life so easily. Okay. Am I... Garrett's compass. From Garrett's. Expect that I buried it somewhere on the southern beach. Considering the northern was the other way. This is going to be the southern beach. That's a fire lizard, isn't it? Pretty sure it is. Yep. Multiple. Even a regular lizard is hard. I need to be able to get them from here and then hope their fire doesn't reach here. Hey, Can you guys get a little bit closer? I haven't upped my bow and arrow yet.
Do you guys think something? Ice, ice lands, ice something. Ice arrow. Oh, I just remembered we also need to have like learning points left for uh we need learning points for the language of the whatevers. Okay, this might work actually. Wow. This is ridiculous. Were we supposed to be way stronger before we came to this area? And then I mean this whole entire map? Three hundred. I don't even know if we're gonna have enough arrows for this. We're gonna speed this up a little bit. Okay, let's hope those were the only two. Because I don't think we can do this again. Nothing there. So just the skin of the reptile, it's not even special for specifically the fire lizard. Oh, there's another one. Let's try to not mingle with that guy and hope that whatever we need is in here. Nope, just a statue of Belia. We haven't done the statue of Inos anymore. Okay, what... What amount of arrows are we looking at? 300 still, that's pretty good. Cannot complain about that. But, I can complain about that. Jesus. How about, what if I swim around them? Is that an option? What the? I'll take it, but... Is that a potion? That's crazy. Maybe I was supposed to go through the site. Maybe they're like, just not mingle with them. Just swim around them. What are you doing, crazy person trying to kill fire lizards? Well, we killed two of them. So that lizard should be okay. It's the fire lizards that are an issue. Here it is. Oh, my god, though. And then God knows what this cave is. No, don't don't shoot the fire lizard. We can't take him. If they walk away far enough, we might be good. Please, do not come for me.
Oh, they're gonna come for me. Uh, I think I found something. Walk away slowly. Okay, we're gonna save because we have the compass. That's a zombie. Those are zombies. Those are a bunch of zombies. Can we take zombies? I don't think so. His armor is completely making it that I cannot touch him. That is something. And I just hit my microphone. So are we going to need magic for that guy? So we have to come back here either way. That's fine. I, d I just want to get away from here. <gasps> just let me out. I mean, this guy I can still take for XP, but... We just have to make sure the fire lizards don't come. Nice. So we can up our dexterity even more, or up our one-handed a little bit more. Or bow. Technically, I, I just want my dexterity to be ridiculously high. If you're gonna want to take on uh, orcs with our bow and arrow, Can I get back out of here? <laughs> Please? You guys are gonna make me swim? Okay, there we go. Sir, we have your compass. What do you give for me? What do you... the? There goes my English. What do you want to give me for it? That was obvious all along. It was you, right? Couldn't get away with that. If he doesn't see that, I can't help him. Here's your compass. Yes, that's it. I never thought I'd see it again. Thanks, man. This time Greg won't get a hold of it again. Here, take this belt in return. It's my most valuable piece. Is it really true? Oh, we got a belt. Anything new? Nothing ever happens anymore since Greg left. If he doesn't see that, I can't help him. Well, we've had that discussion. All over again. Okay, so that was something, and then we gave this guy myself. the hasty herring, and then they said something about the North Beach. For this guy, who apparently is always sleeping. And then we have to go check out the lake, but that's probably for next episode. more lizards. That should be okay. The lurker. Three lurkers. Come on. Not getting any crits. survive this one and not heal. Okay, there we go. We're doing great. <laughs> that wasn't that wasn't that great, but we'll take it. Uh, hello? There we go. Oh no, there's still a cave though. There's still a cave. How about using this? No? There we go. Nothing to be had there. That shipwreck makes me think there might be something there and it's like tempting me. Okay, how bad is this cave? If it's a shadow beast or something, it's a shadow beast. 
Hey. I don't think we can take that yet. We tried not too long ago. What kind of belt did you guys give me? This one. Protection. Oblivion. Large firestorm. But I want to keep that one for like multiple enemies, I think. Okay, save again. I don't know, it's gonna be bad. Yeah, we, we cannot take this yet. I don't think bow and arrow is gonna fare any better. Like, actually, this might work. It might. It'd be nice if I wouldn't have to come back here. Problem is, I just need to hit him enough to... Wish I had an ice block. How about, like, asleep? But he's already asleep. I have one fireball. And I would use this. But it's a lot less damage. And I don't know if we need it for something special. Let's see. Eat this. If I can lure him, actually, if I can lure him, everybody's like, why do you, are you so dedicated to kill him? Because I am. So if I hit him and then climb up somewhere, maybe I should check. We can climb up here, but we're going to have to aim it well. So if I could just hit him once from afar. I put this away. Can I sprint? Come on. He did not even care to jump. Okay, fine, we'll come back for you. So I guess that's it for today. I don't think this is gonna count as cleaning up the beach, but part of it is cleaned, you know? It's something. We'll go see if it counts or not. I don't think so. Hmm. <sighs> The northern beach is all cleared. What about the cave? Have you been there too? Uh... Well, that's part of it too. Come back when you're done. They literally anticipated on this. Okay, in that case, I hope you guys had a great time. And I will see you next time on the Scratching Post.